Hello learners, welcome back to my channel Sradhas Physics. Today we will start with the problems on Cauchy's integral formula. Now let us find the value of the integral, suppose it is given for the closed in contour exponential z divided by z minus 1 into dz. Okay. We have to calculate this integral, suppose i equal to this much around it is given that we have to calculate this integral around the circle around the circle mod z equal to 2. Okay. So, we have to use Cauchy's integral formula here. So, now you can see that if you can remember in Cauchy's integral what Cauchy's integral formula says the Cauchy's integral formula says that the point here this here you can see that in this integration if I will put z minus 1 equal to 0 then the value will be equal to z equal to 1 or we can say that this value z naught equal to 1. This is our z naught or this is z minus z naught or 1 is the value of z naught. The function that we are writing here this is in the form of z minus z naught. So, here I can say that the value of z naught is 1 because it is in the form of z minus 1. Now, here we know the Cauchy's integral formula. The Cauchy's integral formula says that if this point z naught point it lies within that contour here it is given that mod z equal to 2 and this point z naught equal to 1 it lies inside this circle z naught equal to 1 this point lies within this the circle mod z equal to 2 means this is the radius of mod z equal to 2 means this radius equal to 2. So, this z naught equal to 1 point it definitely it lies within this circle clear. So, for this point I am writing the expression for the Cauchy's integral formula that is f of z divided by z minus z naught into dz this will be equal to 2 pi i into f of z naught this is our formula. I have already told you in my previous videos. Now, if I will compare this two equation, this two equation, you can see that in place of f of z, this is e power z, clear? f of z is here, e power z. So, this is e power z and in place of f of z naught, in place of f of z naught, here z naught value is 1. So, this will be equal to e power 1 this will be equal to e clear. So, the value of this integration i this will be equal to 2 pi i into in place of f of z naught I can write 2 pi i here and in place of f of z naught I am writing e. So, this is our final answer 2 pi i e clear. And one more thing is that suppose in place of z minus this point is suppose z minus 3 suppose this this question already solved we have already solved this question one now let us suppose in place of one this is suppose another integration exponential z divided by z minus 3 dz and you have to calculate this around mod z equal to 2 so for this case for this case you can see that this z equal to 3 or this z not equal to 3 point z not equal to 3 point it definitely it will lie outside the circle. So, for that you can write the directly the integration value will be equal to 0. Now, let us take another example. Suppose this is the integration over i equal to integration over the close contour c sin z divided by z into dz. Here this is around the condition is that mod z equal to 2. So, we have to use this condition. So, according to the Cauchy's integral formula here also you can see that the point is z naught equal to 0 because here z is present. So, I can write z as z minus 0 or this z naught equal to 0. This z naught equal to 0 point it lies within this contour 2 inside this point 2 it lies z naught equal to 0 this point lies within this contour. Now, we can solve this by using Cauchy's integral formula here also 
f of z equal to sin z. If I will compare the equation, we know Cauchy's integral formula says f of z divided by z minus z naught into dz will be equal to 2 pi i into f of z naught. This is our formula. So, for f of z equal to sin z and if I will put z naught value that is f of z naught equal to 0 here. So, f of 0 will be equal to this is sin 0. You know the value of sin 0 is 0. You can directly write 0 or I am writing here for this expression here this will be equal to I am writing here i equal to 2 pi i into in place of f of z naught this will be 0 into 0. So, that will be equal to 0 clear. Now, the next question suppose this is question number 3 let i equal to this is question number 3 integration over the close contour c exponential z divided by z plus 1 power 4 this is z plus 1 whole power 4 into dz and here we have to calculate around the circle the condition is given around the circle mod z equal to 3 it means our radius is 3 first what we have to calculate the value of z naught so what is the value of z naught this is this should be in the form of z minus z naught so this will be i can write this as z minus of minus 1 so here the value of z naught will be equal to minus 1 or you can write as z plus 1 equal to 0 so that z equal to minus 1 so here we have calculated z naught equal to minus 1 and here f of z equal to you know f of z equal to exponential z. So, this is equal to exponential z clear. Now, what we have to do first is that we have to check this condition that is our circle is circle have the radius 3 our circle have the radius 3 and here our point is minus 1 you can imagine that suppose this is our 0 point or this origin center as 0 and this radius as this total radius is 3 and if I will draw this total diameter then you can imagine this as minus 3 this will be 3 0 and this will be minus 3. So, definitely minus 1 point lies inside this part inside this circle. Now, we have at least this much sure that this point lies inside this contour C or this contour or this circle having radius 3. So, applying the Scotch's integral formula, I am here applying Scotch's integral formula that is since you can see that this is the power of 4. So, we can apply this as suppose this integration over C f of z divided by z minus z naught power n plus 1 dz n plus 1 whole into dz. So, this will be equal to how much? 2 pi i divided by n factorial into f f this is the derivative of this is nth derivative of f of z or this is I am writing f n z naught clear. This is our formula for Cauchy's integral formula for the nth power. Now, just try to compare these two equation in place of f of z this is exponential z and z minus z naught z naught is your minus 1 and n plus 1 means this n plus 1 equal to 4 here. So, n will be equal to 3 this power 4 this will be equal to n plus 1. So, the value of n will be equal to 3. Now, substitute the value here. So, this will be equal to I am writing here i will be equal to this formula I am applying 2 pi i divided by n factorial means this will be 3 factorial into first you you must write f of z equal to since this is exponential z then you have to take the nth derivative then you have to take the third derivative here since n is 3. So, you have to take the third derivative of exponential z. So, this will be again exponential z. Now, we have to put the z naught value that is the value of z naught is minus 1 here. So, I have to put minus 1 in place of z. So, this will be exponential minus 1 or we can write it as 1 by e clear. Now, I have to write here this is 2 pi i 
by n factorial. So, this will be i equal to 2 pi i by 3 factorial into in place of f n z naught I can write 1 by e and if I will solve this, this will becomes 2 pi i this 3 factorial can be written as 3 into 2 into 1 this 2 to get cancelled. So, the remaining will be pi i pi i divided by 3 into e this is our i equal to this much. Okay. Now, let me summarize the Cauchy's integral theorem and Cauchy's integral formula. In case of Cauchy's integral theorem, here I am just writing like this Cauchy's integral theorem. In case of Cauchy's integral theorem, this theorem states that if the function f of z, this function is analytic, if this function f of z is analytic, then here analytic means this should be analytic at all points interior to and on this contour c. So, in that case the integration over f of z dz, the integration over this closed contour will be equal to 0. So, this is Cauchy's integral theorem, but what Cauchy's integral formula says? This Cauchy's integral formula says again if this function f of z is analytic this function should be analytic interior to and on the contour c this is a simple contour c then at any interior point z naught if i will consider any interior point z naught for that this value f of z naught will be equal to 1 by 2 pi i into integration over this close contour c f of z divided by z minus z naught into dz. Okay. This is our Cauchy's integral formula. It means that if this z naught point, if this z naught point it lies outside or the exterior to C, then in that case here also you can see that in case of Cauchy's integral theorem also if any point z 0 is exterior to C, then the integral f of z divided by z minus z naught, this it is analytic everywhere on and within that contour. Okay, on and within that contour C, the condition should be z minus z naught should not be equal to 0. In that case, the function is analytic, but by so by applying this Cauchy's integral theorem, this f of z divided by z minus z naught dz, this will be equal to 0. So, if I will combine this to Cauchy's integral theorem and Cauchy's integral formula, if I will summarize this to, then what we will get? 1 by 2 pi i into integration over f of z divided by z minus z naught into dz this will be equal to the one value will be f of z naught this will be f of z naught if this z naught point is exterior to c it lies out outside to the c or this is exterior to c and the value will be 0 if z naught point if sorry this is interior to c and if z naught is exterior to c then the value will be 0 ok clear this is the value will be f of z naught if this is interior to c and the value will be 0 if this lies outside the c outside that close contour c ok. So, this is all for today thank you.